Welcome to Wednesday. I'm Coach Skip at Wildfire CrossFit. Uh, we're in the middle of the week. Hopefully it seems like a short week with Memorial Day over the weekend. Uh, we are going to get into it. We got a warm up. We're going to go two rounds for quality. So really focus on good quality movements here. You're going to do a 200 meter run. If you got the distance, great. Otherwise do 30 seconds out and back again or one minute of cardio, running in place, jumping jacks, jump rope, whatever you need to get that heart rate up a little bit. Then we're gonna do 10 no push up burpees. So right back, up and jump, get that fast movement, explode through it, get those hips working. Then we'll get into plate, ground to overhead. So you're gonna grab that plate and you're gonna dip the cookie in the milk and then feed the monster. Use that plate to really explode and get those muscles moving hip pop, shoulder pop, all the way up, and then right back down again. Then we've got 10 side lunges all the way down. Keep that chest up and just back and forth, five on each leg. Then we're gonna finish with 10 Superman. So right up, get that chest and thighs off the ground, and right back down again. Two rounds, get warmed up, get that heart rate up. And then we got a great workout for you today. For the workout today, we've got a 30 minute AMRAP and there is a bunch of exercises in here, so pay attention. We're gonna start with 40 one arm dumbbell burpees. So how that's gonna work is you're gonna have your dumbbell there, you're gonna do a burpee, and then as you stand up, you're grabbing that dumbbell and then right back down. If you wanna alternate arms, you can, you don't have to, but that's just a good way to keep it even on both sides or do 20 on one side, 20 on the other. That'll help just your body feel better through this workout. After that, we're gonna do 40 ab mat sit-ups. So grab your trusty ab mat. If you don't have one, you can always use a towel or a pillow. Shoulders all the way to the ground, right up. Get those elbows past the knees every single time on these. Then you're gonna go on a 200 meter run or do one minute of cardio, whatever you need to do to get that heart rate up. You can do a 250 row, you can bike, you can do whatever you need to do, just keep it moving. After that, we're gonna go into 30 one arm hang snatch. This is gonna be alternating. So you are gonna alternate every ar uh, on each arm every time. Again, really get those hips open, get that big hip hop overhead and uh, just back and forth. On that hang, you're going no lower than just above the knee every time on that movement. After that, we've got 30 box step ups. So you're right up, standing tall on that box, right back down. And then again, do your best to switch legs every single time just to keep it going. Then you're gonna go back to 200 meter run. You can do whatever you did in that first one if you don't have a spot to run. Then we've got 20 alternating one arm devil press. So on that devil press, as you go down, you are going to grab that dumbbell, come up and then pop those hips straight up and overhead and then switch arms right down, right up, pop that dumbbell overhead, right back down. So that's two of those devil presses right there. Then we've got 20 Russian twists. So you're gonna be on your butt, heels off the ground, and just back and forth here. You can use a plate, a med ball, a dumbbell, a kettlebell, whatever you've got. That's about 25 pounds for guys, 10 pounds for girls. Finally, you're gonna finish with a 200 meter run. And the best part is, that's not all. Once you get done with that round, you're gonna keep going and start over at the beginning and just work for 30 minutes, as many rounds as possible. Great hump day workout, have fun with it, and we'll see you soon here at Wildfire CrossFit.